see how Sharp is going to deal with this day one character. Both characters are heavy hitters, but... Oh, this is a button check. Just a button check. So, or it was a... Uh... Oh, Nico has a uh, cheese tag. Yeah, that would uh, definitely not... Uh, be great to start things. So... Um, yeah. All right, here we go for real. Nico with the E attack. That's how you know. One, go! Let's see if our player is jogging in position in neutral. Okay, spot dodge to down throw. Grab down throw. Derek confirm for the Sharpie to take the lead. There's another spot dodge attempt. Avoid the grab. Oh, that side B gets revenged. Oh, man. I wonder how much that's going to be worth. Oh, man. Nico is looking at the... Uh... Oh, man. He read that uh, Nico is attempting to get out of disadvantage and nails with that disjointed bear for the kill. 3-2 stock lead for uh, Sharpie. He's like here. Oh, yeah. I guess he was waiting to see how uh, Nico was going to respond to the violence. Another revenge. Oh, wow. They're almost, it's almost a stock lead lap for Sharpie. And now it is. Detail on ledge, detail on fair. Oh, you try to use Nair to make uh, uh, Nico, to punish Nico's uh, tether grab attempt. Nico landing on side B, but it's not a lot of end lap. Sharp is able to charge in there and get a nice uh, grab down back throw attempt. Nico low recovery, Nico goes down low, as he is very accustomed to with his main shoulder. Seems to think that Violet has the tools for that. Your folks are thinking of remaining violent, but they're taking notes. Okay, I'm trying to use the uh, side B as a get off me to return the ledge, but Sharpie is patient and made him pay for it. There you go, now it's a little bit of mid range. So while Sharpie did have stage control, Nico is now taking it completely back. Edge guard attempt here from Nico. We're going to try to take the stock, and there we go. Sharpie got a little bit uh, selfish and greedy there with the side B off the ledge. He can maybe get a bear for it. Oh! Detail to there. Like he's been doing all night. Sharpie is getting so much off of these two frame details to end stocks. It's an optimal way to play him so far. Now he's making Nico kind of retreat. But Sharpie is very patient. He's willing to make it. He's willing to wait. Down for the bear right there. Confirm. Makes Nico get a nair when he tries to recover quickly. Nico's trying to use that so to get enough distance. Oh, clink right there. Oh, it's not clink off the down tilt, but Sharpie is able to recognize the situation. Revenge. Uh, Nico's follow up. Cross chop. Last hitbox there. And, oh man, Sharpie closes things out with a nearly mid in the center stage. Oh, that's right there. Taking the 1 0 lead. They'll be going back to uh, PS2. See if Nico is able to uh, maybe change things up with uh, Violet's recovery to try to avoid some of the two, uh, two framing from uh, Sharpie's decent at ledge. Just some patient neutral play. Sharpie's not willing to just run in there and get hammered on by Violet's first options. Ooh. Here we go. Nico almost with a uh, frame trap there on top of the platform. Up smash. Sharp in this space there twice and gets a punish for it. Ooh, almost with that F tilt right in there. That's that fair. Oh! Just barely whiffs. He's able to sneak in the end of cross chop right there before he's able to punish that. You pretty much throw an F smash in your legs and cross chop to catch the uh, down of the box. I don't know, just so you guys know. 
Shark is trying to press his advantage with E-Tilt, but Nico is able to escape back to neutral on center stage. Nico hasn't quite figured out how to use the bow at all. It doesn't any of that. It's a really perplexing option. But there you go. Get up attack. You always get one. You always get one. He's uh, jumping a little love attempt by Sharpie. Whiffs and then he uh, eats the Back here. Wow. Ledge Trump right there makes a 3-2 game. Back throw. Sharpie trying to close ends out here and maybe the game two. But oh man. That down air is a killer. Yeah, he's even things up here. Nico's doing a little bit better job not getting uh, two frames so far. He's not putting some certain air as much. Sharpie is also playing patient. Going through the motions, there's a carry on the arrow. He goes over to punish him though. And nearly did he gets revenge, eats a uh, parry into the Dariot. Looks like Sharpie is slowly squeaking away the game. There we go. Short hop, low on the lip. Isn't enough to kill that percentage range. Oh man, that was a great retreat from Sharpie to make uh go pay with the landing on platform and bear. Nice landing fair from Sharpie. He's being very patient with his edge guard. He's not even resorting to the detail right now. Just keeping things at a distance before maybe crowding the legs next time. Oh, Nico gets the uh, punishes Sharpie for not teching uh, properly. Now Nico is the one who's using that distance to try and keep Sharpie at ledge. But oh man, at 150, it's a kill. Uh, PS2 with an up throw on the scale. So now we have Nico uh, on his last stock with here on game two, but right now he's just playing tennis with <laughs> Sharpie's hitboxes and he just follows up a few uh, four aerials with the kill right there. He even picks up one stock piece. Spot dodge and carry it. Now Sharpie's trying to press his advantage with some F tilt. Now he's got Nico back at ledge. Oh, that's right, up he can recover tether from great distance. I know that's not over, quite over to pile up when they're that far down the blast. Zone. Nice landing here from Sharpie to catch Nico sleeping a little bit. They clank on tilts. Sharpie gets patiently by retreating, but he's able to revenge that. Looking to use that revenge to maximum effect. Nair from Nico. Right in the bear ring. Charlie game two. Oh man. And Nico's already figured out. Oh, and the up smash is the raw up smash, right? As I was about to explain that Nico figured out the placing for that. Detail two frame, but Sharpie now the 2-0 lead here in winners finals. Let's see if uh, we're gonna see a venue change. No, we're not gonna see a venue change going back to PS2. And the characters are staying the same. Let's see if uh, things change. <laughs> Oh man. Three, so. two, one, Once again, Bile, a new DLC character, fire up on three houses. Against Sharpie's are visiting the same player from the Dominican Republic. Spot dodge. Both players spot dodge right there. Get the advantage. Nice roll in behind. Use help. Dash attack right there from Sharpie. They each fair from Nico. It's right back. Get up attack. Nico's a little grout and we'll try and throw him off stage. He doesn't really go quite far at this early percent. So reach the get up attack into a grab. Fair. Confirm. Down throw. Oh, he parries the down air into a Darian. Oh, Nico. Tech chase right there. Almost like Sharpie Pain. That's just continuing to make him pain. Oh, the Sharpie's able to land right through Sharp, uh, Nico's whip. Side B there from Sharpie trying to get a little free. All in of our players block that small so look close like Nice nair from Sharpie out of shield. Let's see if he's able to close the stock out right here. Nice. Catches Nico with a fair. Down throw, up air, up air, maybe another up air. Oh, maybe he was able to get out of it. Parries the uh, lanyard. That clothesline is just so cool. 
2 uh, 3 2 stock advantage here for Sharpie here in game 3 of the Winners Finals. Oh, he tried to land with revenge. It was just space, this space enough by Nico that he essentially got punished out of it. There we go. Spot dodge, down tilt, up there. So Nico trying to bring things back. Sharpie is definitely in the kill range for any of the violence, just explosive options, whether it's a down B or even side B. Although I've noticed that Nico is really not been able to resort to anything like a normal aerial. Some up B. Down tilt to nearly a fair firm. Oh man. And a whip! And there we go. Nico is on his last stock of winners right now. Oh! <laughs> Sharpie got greedy with the uppy, just draw, and Nico wasn't able to punish it immediately. That was kind of funny. There you go, spot dodge detail, trying to press an advantage. Nico gets to be a punisher. Nice back air there from Sharpie. Because he can get right in place for a detail, but doesn't have to be Revenge is the aerial attempt from Nico. Sharpie trying to close things out right there with the revenge power F tilt. Oh, that was a nice detail to up air combo from Nico. Nice confirmed. Fair. Sharpie is trying to corner. Nico is violent right now. Oh, that was a great fair to uh, dash attack. Confirm. Nico missed the attack. Oh, he tried to read him with the back here. That would kill. I got to put Nico in serious jeopardy some more. Sharpie very patient in his recovery, holding on to his jump until the very last. Try to shield through that with either poetry let go shield to him. Oh, that was a go for Epsom after a forward throw right there. Will Sharpie get the edge guard here? Oh, that was a cool exchange. And then Sharpie hitting the Darien. Oh, we tried to go for the whip. He got greedy. Now both players on their last stop. Let's see if Nico can bring this back and take us to game four. If Sharpie's going to close it out. It's looking very deep. Um, oh man, the re grab with the up B, I guess it doesn't. Uh, oh, and the up smash out of shield for Sharpie to take it and move on to grand final. Wow. Sharpie just uh, showing the power of Incineroar on stream. But of course, Nico playing our the, the 